Have you ever thought about where your produce comes from? Most grocery chains receive produce from various local and national farmers. In fact, there are about 3.4 million farmers in the United States today. But of that staggering number, only 45,000 are black farmers. At The Better Buggy, we are a proud group of Atlanta-based black-owned farmers, selling produce locally and nationwide. Our easy-to-navigate online platform makes it easy for you to make a one-time purchase or to simplify your life by subscribing to our weekly produce box. Whichever frequency you choose, you can order with confidence knowing you'll receive 100% organic farm fresh produce. If you're looking for a thoughtful gift for a loved one that they'd actually find useful, be sure to pop by our online store where you can snag a gift card your recipient can use to order their own produce and t-shirts. Ready to start supporting local black owned farms and making healthier food decisions? Visit thebetterbuggy.com now to start shopping. Ladies and gentlemen, Karen calling black neighbors the N-word on ring camera. Now I'll tell you what's going on here and it's actually kind of funny. Now I would show y'all the video, but the video on TikTok has since been taken down and it did go viral and everything. So apparently Karen lives directly across the hall from black neighbors and there's other black people in this complex and many of them have ring cameras. Karen is upset because she's a sex worker and it's picking up her clientele coming in and out of her apartment. So she's ticked off about that and have been using the N word on these black neighbors, which they have the right to have a ring camera. It's not illegal. You can have one on your apartment door. You can have one at your home. It doesn't matter. So she was saying it's an invasion of privacy. Really, it isn't. Okay, now, if they were able to film what's going on inside your apartment, then you would have a point. But people walking up and down the hallway or going into their individual apartment, that's not illegal. And that's not an invasion on privacy. Sorry, Karen. <laughs> that one just ain't going to work. So... This is August 20th, 2021. So a TikTok video went viral of Karen using the N-word as she walked by Black residents' apartment units. So she was caught uttering the racial slur. And um, the neighbor said at first they didn't even know she was walking past and doing this until they rolled back the ring camera footage, and that's when they caught it. But they had no idea she was even doing that. So on TikTok, it was viewed 360,000 times. It has since been removed. You know, I don't know if they removed it on their own or you never know. So the woman notes that, you know, her white neighbor who is unidentified in the grainy footage had the nerve to say this in the hallway full of black people with ring cameras. <laughs> well, I don't blame people in the black community for getting that. So many um, people have gone through so much. And it's also a matter because they got this society trained and conditioned to believe anything from white people and dismiss anything from black people. So that being said, that's why so many of them got it now. Even out here in your suburbs and even in the hood, people got ring cameras that <laughs> they do, you know, and it, it is a way of defending yourself against people like Karen that are coming up or, or doing derogatory things. Now, look, I've done stories where cops, got caught on ring camera saying and doing inappropriate things. And even um, I did a story a couple, about, I would say in July, of a man that was upset over his neighbors having a BLM sign. And he started defecating on their front porch. The idiot didn't know the whole thing got picked up on ring camera. 
<laughs> I mean, he didn't know. And he did it multiple times. But the whole thing got picked up on ring camera. So these folks got to understand things have changed. It has changed. You know, and, and you know, the ring camera thing is just not going to work in their favor. Especially when they're out doing what this Karen is doing. So not only did Karen uh, get upset because all these black neighbors got ring cameras. The woman that posted this on TikTok. She and uh, another girlfriend went to the pool. And when they got to the pool, Karen and another woman was there and they were shouting out the N-word. They were shouting the N-word out. So I don't know what that's supposed to do, but she did ask a neighbor to remove or move their uh, ring camera to another spot. But this neighbor did comply and moved the ring camera. And guess what? It still was picking up everything Karen was doing. <laughs> it still picked up all of her uh, Johns that were coming in and out of her apartment. And, you know, she being a sex worker, it was still picking all of that up. It didn't matter that it was moved. And it's because it can pick up a, a certain range. So even if you move it, uh, you know, a small distance from where you had it, it's still going to pick up everything. I guess she thought it was going to make a difference. I mean, after all, y'all, it is Karen, you know. <laughs> so, y'all, I wish I could have showed you the footage. You know, I was really kind of surprised that it was taken down. But I can still do the story. So you can hear why old Karen here was so upset and so mad at her neighbors, you know. And Karen, you don't have to live around black people. You must not be doing so well if you got all those black neighbors. And besides, there's many places you can go to live, even apartments where it's not many, um, you know, black residents there. So, hey, I guess if you're going to set up shop there, then everything's going to be caught. Your, your clientele got to understand <laughs> you're going to be caught walking down the hallway to your apartment to get it on. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.